Hello everyone and welcome to MLB The Show 16. I'm going to do a little home run derby here today. Now I, a little while ago today I recorded the Madden 16 Gauntlet video that should be up on my channel already. Hope so. And I decided, you know, I haven't tried home run derby on the show. So, what are we going to do today guys? We're going to try the home run derby on the show. So I take over Miguel Sano whom I really don't swing the bat that well with, honestly, in my Diamond Dynasty. I just don't like his stance that much. I don't usually use players that tall, and his stance is just kind of weird. So, we'll see how this goes. But I'm trying to do an online home run derby here, and we'll see if I can uh, do anything cool. I just wanted to try out some other modes and have some fun here on this channel, and just see what you guys think, because I like playing these random modes. And we'll see how many people are even online right now. I'm recording this at like 9.55 on Friday morning. I'm not sure when this video is going up. Probably Saturday, Sunday. I don't know what day. But we'll see. This could be a 1v1 against David Ortiz. Or maybe not. So it's going to be a three-person home run derby. And I have the weakest of the three. Chris Davis is 89 power, David Ortiz with 85, and Miguel Sano with 80. And hopefully I can actually uh, swing well with him today. Right to a lot of the hits I have with him in my Diamond Dynasty are home runs. So it's a bad average, but got some home runs in there. So here we go. Oh my... I just missed. I need to stop recording now, guys. That's it for today. Have a great day, guys. See you next time. Or maybe I'll try again. All right, Sano popping it up, it looks like. Or, no, that went deep to the outfield. What am I thinking? I couldn't judge that trajectory at all. I'm in the lead, though, one nothing. You guys are losing to a dude who missed the first swing. And that one's going away, so if you follow the shadow, it's a little bit easier. And I go way out, 455. Let's go. And Miguel Sano launching another one to center. Where's that one going to go? 438. That's it? Wow, there's an out. That was pretty close. Look at that trajectory. And now a base hit to right. Maybe extra bases. But I'm at three home runs. I should be in the lead here. Doing pretty good. Can I hang on? Miguel Sano to left. That's probably extra bases too. But now I think I'm tied as Chris Davis still does not have a home run. And I think I got one here. Deep to left center. Good night. 459. These are some big home runs by Miguel Sano. That is not a good pitch. Should take should took it. But I still might get out into the bullpen. Or maybe not quite. Oh, it did! Just enough. Five homers now. Oh man, do you see that David Ortiz has like a 489 foot homer? That's probably aided by, is that aided at all by the fact that there's no bleachers beyond the first deck there and right? Probably. 486, my bad. Now to right field. Oh man, off the wall. So I'm at five homers. What's the update? Five. Okay, Ortiz in the lead right now. So I'm guessing like we're gonna have a uh, finals after this because it says semis right now. So I just need to like find a sweet spot here. Don't have to beat Ortiz in this round necessarily as I ground out the second. But this Chris Davis is not getting anything. Or he has two. And now maybe three. So let's not fall asleep. He could catch up. Man, I'm hitting some really good non-home runs while I'm at it here. All right, I'm at five. Ortiz at nine. And, uh, man, you can't foul off pitches in the home run derby. But I'm doing it. What do we got now? There we go. A drive to left center. And that is gone. 469. My longest homer. Still four behind David Ortiz. And we're going to left again. Back to back home runs here. 413. Is this a good way to gain XP, by the way? Didn't think about that. 
Right center now. Wow, we're going to like the same location. And I think mine went a little bit further. 430 there. Eight home runs. I have like three in a row. And I was way early that time. There's a souvenir. Imagine like being at the home run derby and you get a ball, but it was a foul. Like that's the lamest thing ever. Just give that one away. Come on. Like, yeah, I got this ball. Oh, who hit it? Well, uh, Miguel Sano did, but I sat behind home plate. It was a bad swing. Like, that's not a good enough story to keep the ball. It just isn't. One minute remaining. Going to center now, and it looks like I have another one. Another 467. Or maybe, maybe that's actually better. Because a home run derby foul ball has more rarity than an actual home run ball. So maybe the foul isn't that lame. What do you guys think? As I... Oh, this is all timed. I thought we were like dealing with outs here. I didn't even realize that it was just completely based on time. And that taking a swing didn't really benefit you. I'm not sure how it works. But I know I have less time than everybody else, so I'm not exactly sure what's going on. Hey, I got a trophy. Going deep to center. There we go. I, I wonder if, like, this is helping me with Sano. I should go play some Diamond Dynasty as I go 488. I have the second longest home run now of the Derby. I wonder if this is actually improving my timing, though, with Miguel Sano. Running out of time, though. I'm three behind Big Poppy. And I think I missed again. That was up and away. I have maybe one more swing. Oh, no, we all have the same amount of time. What am I talking about? I don't know. There's another one as time expires. So I had a pretty good round. I didn't win. But now it looks like we go to the finals. I had 13. He had 15. And we'll see who takes home the final round. How many minutes is this one? Hitting first. Five minutes to hit as many home runs as I can. And we're getting off to a good start. I don't even see his vector, so... Oh, there it is. Please go foul. It did. Oh, it didn't! Come on! I have another one! And I think uh, Ortiz might as well. Two to two. And a base hit. And a foul, so we're matching each other pretty well so far. Now, does the tie go to me because I'm, like, home field advantage? That'd be a cool rule. Man, another base hit. And he's now ahead by one. Oh, man, I saw his ball leave, and it kind of distracted me there. That was strange. Pulled that one. It was away in the zone, but... Oh, come on! That high off the fence. Are you kidding me? To center. I'm not sure if that one's going to be able to get out. I'm falling behind here. I started off pretty good. And now Ortiz is pulling away. 5-2. to two. And there we go to right field. Now let's hope he misses a few. So I can play catch up. That was a weird pitch. I didn't like it. Still might leave. Nope. Why did I pick a a righty and want to do this at target field. I should have picked a lefty. I get that short. Well, I guess the left field fence is pretty low too. Oh, off the foul pole. See, I'm not sure why I hit better with lefties, but like in my series, Desmond Payne better as a lefty. Super Mega Baseball, I do better with the lefty hitters. Diamond Dynasty, they do better with lefties. And I'm right-handed. It doesn't make any sense. I hit right-handed. I throw right-handed. Although I have noticed lately, I do drink with my left hand. I never pick up a glass with my left with my right hand. That's a fun fact. And quietly here, I think I've crept up 9-7 to seven now. 
And I might go four in a row. Right, center, and deep. Goodbye. Oh no, off the high part. Never mind, I spoke too soon. There we go. Left center this time. I don't think that one's falling in the field of play. And it was way closer than I thought. Oh no. It was off that little uh, score ticker. Left field once again. 454. 10 to 9 right now. Rounded. And that one's going out, so I'm down by two again. Way out. And I have less time on the clock. There we go. Ortiz hits a little short tapper, and I go 470. And now go into center, but Ortiz might leave as well. We both leave. Okay. 12 to 11. Oh, I missed. Not good. Now that first round was 15 to 13. I think we're both going to end up with more home runs. Could anyway. I need him to miss a couple. That's foul, right? Should be. Actually, I can't really tell. It's 14-12. And that one is going to allow me to catch up one. We're inside a minute to go now. Come on. Do I have it in me? 14-13. Sano to right center, but I think Poppy is going yard as well. Come on, I'm only down by one. Sano to right center again. Poppy got underneath that one. I went way out. And Ortiz flies out. So now we're tied at 15, maybe one or two swings more. No, I had it low and away, but pulled it. Let's go, Miguel Sano. 16 homers. I should be winning. Oh, no, we're tied at last swing. Come on! Deep to left center as Ortiz goes to right. Wow, what a home run derby here. Did we just tie? That was a great derby. Unless he, like, didn't leave the yard there. No, we're tied at 17. Oh, no, we had more time left. And that's the game winner right there over the scoreboard. Over the scoreboard with my picture on it. Well, that's basically the baseball equivalent of getting dunked on. So, I lose the home run derby. I had a pretty good derby, though, I thought. I had 17 home runs there in the final round. I was pretty clutch down the stretch, but David Ortiz wins the home run derby. He's probably going to play in the Derby this year, isn't he? He's probably going to win it, too. So maybe I'm predicting the future here. I'm not sure. But if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Hit that subscribe button. I'm just trying out some other modes on different sports games today. And I'm having a good time. So I hope you guys are as well. I'll see you guys later. Have a great day.